Hey everyone, welcome to the T4 Show. My name is Michael Manna, and today we're gonna unbox uh, what I believe to be are a pair of Bluetooth stereo headphones uh, from Jaybird. And I'd like to thank Canvas for sending it out so quickly. I would have had the unboxing sooner, but uh, due to my move to Florida, these got sent to Connecticut. So it got forwarded and I got it today. So now I'm gonna go on unboxing, obviously Batarang unboxing knife, best present ever. That cuts my hand every time I use it. Ow, like now. This up. Here. Now, I've been using uh, the Tiger Eyes and also the Endorphin Rush headphones. Uh, the Tiger Eyes, I still haven't received back due to warranty, uh, having static in the right ear. But the uh, Endorphin Rushes have, have worked out very, very well. So I'm very happy with those. And these are the SB1 Sport Band Bluetooth headphones. Let me see what those things run for real quick. While I'm online, just give me a second here. These retail for $89. So the same price as the Endorphin Rush headphones, I believe. And, and the Tiger Eyes. So now we go. Let's bring it out here. So you can see here, this is the way it fits on here. That's what it looks like, but I'm going to take it out of the box. Just bear my boxing knife. It says it comes with a one-year warranty, eight-hour talk and music time, and you can use it for as well as the iPod function on my iPhone. You can use it as a headset to speak on, just like the uh, Rockfish Bluetooth headphones. And there they are. Just like that. There you have a power button. I'm going to bring it up a little closer. You have the volume button, and you have the track button on there. And on the other side, no buttons, just this. No, it's not a button either. So the power button. It, this one doesn't seem to click. So I'm assuming when you tap the power button, you probably answer the phone, or this doesn't have any kind of feedback here. Um, see, I'll adjust here and adjust here down at the bottom on each side. And instead of the Rocketfish, which actually have uh, the behind the ear, like the Motorola S9 uh, headphones, these go like regular headphones over to the top, as you can see in the picture. So I'm actually going to the gym later. I'm gonna give these a try, maybe give an update later today, if not tomorrow. And obviously it takes, ooh, it takes a proprietary plug, USB on one side to charge. Well, actually, it's USB, I'm sorry, it's proprietary into the thing, but the Bluetooth headphones or Rocketfish actually take the same as, say, my Mic Mate Pro or a digital camera charger and such like that. So when I'm on the road, I only take one cable. So this would be an extra cable to carry on the road with me, but it might not be a big deal since uh, these are supposedly very good. And I'm supposed to get the, uh, I think the new S, I think they're the, uh, the 200 M's Bluetooth, uh, the ones, the Freedoms. So I'm hoping to get those soon. And once again, I'd like to thank Candace and everybody at jaybirdgear.com. And for everybody here at the T4 Show, thank you and best of luck in all your future Bluetooth headphone endeavors. Yeah.